The grief is still etched on her face. Yahanara's son drowned four years ago while playing in a Dakar canal. In a bitter irony, a few days beforehand, he'd asked his mother for swimming lessons. It is extremely important for a child to know how to swim. I don't want any mother to suffer the agony I'm going through. Every child should be taught how to swim. Bangladesh is a country crisscrossed by deltas, and boat accidents and drownings are all too frequent. Drowning is the biggest cause of death among people under 18, with a child dying in water every 30 minutes on average. In response, the government has pledged to make swimming lessons mandatory for all school children. I was scared of water before. My mother and the instructor and then a lot of people helped me learn to swim. Now I can swim. Few people here know how to swim, often because of a lack of facilities in one of the world's poorest countries. To help counter that, UNICEF is providing inflatable pools and some funding. It also hopes to change attitudes. One of the challenges I can see is probably for uh, girls and young women, because traditionally for young women to be swimming and to be active in sports is not something that's very uh, culturally accepted in some areas, but we're breaking those taboos. With some 230 rivers and around 40 million people living in coastal areas, the challenge for Bangladesh is huge as it bids to bring an end to so many avoidable deaths.